On day two of his papal visit in Mexico, Pope Francis described the country as a young nation that can still renew and transform itself. This was the first message Pope Francis emphasized as he met with President Enrique Peña Nieto and other local leaders. Along with his wife, Mexico's president welcomed the pope to the country's national palace. Once gifts were exchanged, the pope was given a tour of the premises, which includes a visual history of the nation depicted by late Mexican painter Diego Rivera. In his welcoming speech, the president highlighted that in spite of Mexico's strong separation of church and state, it still promotes religious liberty. On behalf of the country, he officially welcomed the first Latin American pope to Mexico. No tengo duda de que el paso de su santidad dejará una huella imborrable en los mexicanos, pero también estoy seguro de que México dejará una profunda huella en el corazón del Papa Francisco. Su santidad se ha bienvenido a esta tierra, México lo abraza con cariño. Bienvenidas sus palabras, sus bendiciones y su amor para México. Bienvenida su luz. Muchas gracias. In his speech, Pope Francis highlighted three key points. First, he said he visits Mexico as a messenger of mercy and peace, but above all else, as a son of Our Lady. Como hijo que quiere rendir homenaje a su madre, la Virgen de Guadalupe, y dejarse mirar por ella. In his second point, the Pope addressed the country's youth. The fact that about half of Mexico's population is young will allow the nation, he said, to look towards the future with hope. Un pueblo con juventud es un pueblo capaz de renovarse, transformarse. Es una invitación a alzar con ilusión la mirada hacia el futuro y a su vez nos desafía positivamente en el presente. Focusing on the present and not just the future, he said, is based on the input of both the government and its citizens. Y esto no es solo asunto de leyes que requieran de actualizaciones y mejoras, siempre necesarias, sino de una urgente formación de la responsabilidad personal de cada uno, con pleno respeto del otro, como corresponde en la causa común de promover el desarrollo nacional. At the end of his speech, a long, heartfelt applause followed. <laughs> this marked the first time a pope has visited Mexico's national palace. Once the visit ended, the pope put on his coat, got in the pope mobile, and made his way towards his next meeting with Mexican bishops.